Hi friends, uh, welcome to another edition of um, Gozi Atiti Vlogs and if you're just coming across my channel for the very first time or you've been watching my videos once in a while and you've not subscribed yet please kindly click that red button that says subscribe and that way anytime I upload a video you'll be notified so today I just got a uh, shocking news I mean it was really shocking to me to be sincere about um, Davido's fiance, that's Chioma, that uh, she tested positive for the coronavirus. I mean, when Hobby brought this news to my to my notice, I was super shocked. I mean, one, she's a nursing mother. I was just feeling for her, feeling for the baby. I was just thinking of so many things. I really felt like my heart really went out for her, you know. So and. Um, let me just read the way it is on the other and quickly I went on the internet to to double check on this and to to be sure that this is not just one fake news flying out there and I mean I came across you know that actually is on internet you know so I just want to read to us he says Davido says his fiance trauma test positive for coronavirus Nigeria Afrobeat star Davido has announced that his fiance Choma has tested positive for the new coronavirus. Choma, according to Davido, recently returned from the United Kingdom with their baby. The baby tested negative, the singer said in a series of tweets detailing the reveal. He stated that he decided to take a he decided to take themselves and all their close associates with come a recent contact for the COVID-19 test on the 25th of March. And this was his tweet on his Twitter handle. He said, hey everyone, I came back recently from America after canceling tour. My fierce Choma also came back from London recently with our baby. We had no symptoms and still both feel perfectly fine. But because of our recent travel history, we decided to take ourselves and, and our all close associates. We've come in recent contact with for the COVID-19 test on the 25th of March. Unfortunately, my fiance's result came back positive while all 31 other tested have come back negative, including our baby. We are, however, doing perfectly fine and she's even still yet to show any symptoms whatsoever. She's now being quarantined and I have also gone into full self-isolation for the minimum 14 days. I want to use this opportunity to thank you all for your endless love and prayers in advance and to urge everyone to please stay at home as everyone to please stay at home as we control the spread of this virus together we can beat this love d so there are a few things i i want to take away from this from this information one he was he was selfless and uh, like he rightly said because of their travel history and understanding the need why we need to self isolate ourselves and to you know if you have the opportunity to get yourself tested you test because we are not just doing this for our own self alone but for humanity at large this is this is um this is a pandemic that is scaring the planet earth right now that is scaring humanity so i applaud him for coming back and testing all his you know household including those that are in contact with her. I applaud him for doing that and also applaud him for notifying the public and doing what is needful even though we are told right now we advise right now to to adhere to the social distancing rule we can we can we can hug them we can hug Choma and his family right now with our prayers. I mean, there is no prayer distancing. In as much as I, we all understand the need for social distancing, there is no prayer distancing. So wherever you are, please let's pray for them. It's a very challenging moment. Understanding that she's a nursing mother and, I mean, these are young um these are young lovers i mean it's going to put a real strain on their relationship and we pray that um Choma and her household will come out of this challenge and in as much as she's not showing symptoms right now we pray that her immunity and god will help her fight this coronavirus and this is also to remind us the need to self-isolate and the need that self-isolate yourself when you when you 
going to any social gathering at all even though it's not advisable this time or when you come back from a travel you know observe the 14 days self isolation and if you are if you are not symptomatic, then you can go have a test if you have access to it. To this opportunity to remind us on the steps to take so that we don't come in contact with this deadly virus flying around. So one of them is, number one, wash your hands frequently. Avoid touching your eyes, nose and mouth. Basically, avoid touching your face. Cover your cough using the bend of your elbow. That is this way <coughs> some people say dab when you want to cough like this so avoid crowded places avoid you know social distancing basically stay at home if you feel unwell but right now i don't know the geographical location you are there are places now that is on total lockdown so if the government says stay at, stay at home please stay at home i mean this is not about whether you feel well or well if the government in your area says stay at home, just obey simple instruction, okay? Um, if you have fever, cough, and difficulty breathing, please call the helplines in your area and uh, get more information, educate yourself on how this coronavirus is going. So is this is also, this is a quick reminder that I'm using this opportunity to come make this video. And um, if you have been joking around with this, it's not a joke. Coronavirus is deadly. The vaccine and the cure is not found yet. Scientists are still testing around to see what will help humanity. But for now, the only vaccination that we have now is social distancing and amidst other hygiene rules. Please take it seriously and um, for Choma and the family and for all other uh, COVID-19 positive patients, we let us hug them with our prayers. So from your different quarantine sessions, whether it is your home or a special quarantine um, site, please let's hug them with prayers. Let's pray that God will deliver them and God will help humanity to fight this virus. So I just decided to check on us to know, to find out um, how are you guys doing? I mean, is for me, yes, we're I've been staying indoors. It's beginning to feel like um it's beginning to feel like uh, house arrest, so to speak. But you know what? We just have to do it for each other, okay? And um, again, the weather here is very beautiful. It is spring. So that's why I decided to just come outside and take nice fresh air. You can see my neighborhood. Everyone is quarantined in their homes. It's very quiet here. So until I see you in another video, please stay safe, eat healthy, and... Um, avoid social gathering now if you have to please when you come back before you touch anything in your house wash your hands regularly and step up your hygiene game thank you and uh, stay blessed bye bye